music and printmaking. Printmaking. What's the relationship between jazz and these prints that uh, well, Bearden Well, the relationship, made? I think, is what ins inspiration Bearden took from it. Mm -hmm. I mean, he listened to the music while he worked. Oh. And so, and he knew some of the performers. He went to the clubs in Harlem, you know. He was hanging out. Right. You know, and, and so, sort of the syncopation right, of the music right. played that? into the art. In the, in the surface, in the movement of forms, in the mm -hmm. interplay of colors. Yes. All of that is a part of the, the arrangement, movement. if in you will. In the arrangement, yes. the juxtaposition of imagery. Yes. And so this, the whole notion of syncopation on the surface and this movement of the call and response, all of that you can see in Bearden's art. So he celebrated the blues and the jazz in his work, but deeply in the work, if you were to look at form, composition, perspective, all of it, you would see how he, he defined it on the surface of his work as well. Yes. So it's um, there are so many layers of richness, both in yes. terms of the literary piece, in terms of his art historical knowledge, uh, in terms of his commitment to the the social and political issues of the day, you know, in terms of his mastery of so many different medium. Um, Bearden was a songwriter. He um, authored a book, a children's book, which was published by Simon and Schuster. Wow. I mean, this the dimensions are immense and deep. And really, this is why I will say to you honestly, I fell in love with this man and have worked on behalf of his legacy. And this is why I wanted to ensure that we bring this exhibition to Moad, um, and especially during the period of his um, National Centennial Celebration, mm. which is occurring across the country with exhibitions and a new publication is coming out. And just on so many different levels, this is an artist that needs to be celebrated. And so the works here really demonstrate um, in the way that I don't think any other show can, honestly, um, the range of his iconography, you know, the images and motifs that he, he continually referenced throughout his entire life. It speaks to his intellectualism. It, it speaks to his populism. You know, he made prints because he also wanted to do a couple of things. One, he, he wanted to have uh, artwork that was accessible to a broad public who did not have the resources, let's say, to buy a painting or a collage. He was very conscious of that. He made some of the prints as well to be able to support other artists and other institutions. Some were made to support his wife, Nanette uh, Bearden, with her dance company, the Nanette Bearden Contemporary Dance Company. Yes. Theater. And so there was a generosity of spirit 